Hello, sweeties. So I'm going to show you how I made my traveler's notebook bookmark. Um, I'm going to make two and show you how to do it. I'm going to make one for traveler's notebook and one for a ring bound because I've recently been getting back into ring bound planners. So, let's, pretty much, <laughs> she, she's exposed my secret, why is she like this? <laughs> okay, so this is the thing that we're making, I've got one of these little today things from the Planner Society, what? Whatever the hell they're called. Like some kind of die cut thingy. I don't know what they're called. Tabs. I don't know. Tabs are the other thing. Die cut tabs. I don't whatever the these things are called, we're gonna use those. Everything that I'm gonna use is from the Planner Society. Except these Target Dollar Spot pockets. I'm gonna show you how you can use those in your planner. So you will need a pair of scissors. I am going to use a corner rounder. Not pictured is my my laminator. Yeah, and it in real life it looks kind of green. It's like it's like a turquoise. So you will need a glue stick. I am going to use my paper cutter, which is a Fiskars paper cutter, and you will need a laminating sheets. So the papers that I'm going to use are these. I'm going to use this one with this die cut. Are these all from the book you're saying? Um, um, everything except this vellum is from the most recent Planner Society kit. Gotcha. The pockets, these little doodads, the paper, let's see, the tabs, everything. Alright, so I'm going to use, where did I put it? Where did it go? Where did you put what? My, my pre-made booklet, bookmark. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this as a little guide because I want it to be about the same size. I'm going to cut them both at the same time because I want them both to be the same size. So basically this is maybe an inch shy of being the width of a B6 page. Does that make sense? If you're measuring, that is. So, I'm going to slide that out. That is my extra. Actually, I'm not done with that yet. I got to cut them down as well. Right about there looks pretty good. Sorry if you guys can't see perfectly because my filming setup, as always, leaves something to be desired. I'm going to. They can get a good, big, nice chunk of that laptop. 
I mean, probably. Well, I don't know how to make it better, so. I don't know how to make it better. Shut everything up. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to round the corners with my We Are Memory Keepers Crocodile Corner Chomper, which is an amazing name. Crocodile? Yes, that's a crocodile. And I'm going to do half an inch because I like half an inch. Wouldn't it be amazing if I had like a desk? Yeah, what would you In the back room, ideally. Because we would take the bed out, obviously. Good. That means no one can stay overnight. So, corners, rounded. Just because I like it, you don't have to do that. And, so it's only for aesthetics. So, which one am I going to do now? I don't remember. You were going to do gold on the blue. And I'm going to do this one on the blue. Right? Hmm? This one. Today? On the blue? Oh, yeah. And you were going to do gold on the bottom. Yeah, right? What were you going to do on the bottom? I'm going to do today. I'm going to do today on the vellum. And I'm committing a cardinal sin here today because I'm going to laminate my vellum, which I swore I would never do because I love the sound that vellum makes. But I kind of want the transparency, that slight transparency that vellum gives. So next, we are going to use our glue stick, and I'm going to glue everywhere. that dry for a minute and do the other one. I know, Day Day is like tucked in right now, you guys. Today is a designated nap day. Apparently it's Monday, so obviously. Oh my god, it's Monday after, it's the first day back from spring break. Yeah. So I get, I, I bet you like all kinds of out of it today. This is some grade A bullshit. That's what Dede says. Dede mm -hmm. says this is some grade A bullshit. So there we go. Put that to dry for a minute. And I'm going to get my laminating sheets ready. I use the kind that like seal on the bottom. So you open it up like that. And I'm gonna stick this one right in all the way to the bottom. Close it up. And then I'm not gonna show you guys, but I'm gonna feed it through my laminator. I have the scotch laminator and I'll link everything that I used down below. I always run my stuff through my laminator twice by the way. I don't know why. Just to make sure it's really sealed. But I do. Yeah. I don't know if it makes any difference, but it makes me feel better, so that's all that matters. Day -day. Yes, I can hear day day. So basically, I run it through and then I flip it over and run it through again. I 
And while I wait for that, I will get the other one. I have no idea what you're talking about. I told you Tamagotchi, they did a, they made an app. I wasn't listening then. Wow. <laughs> so I'm going to run the other one through. So there's a Tamagotchi app. Yeah. And it's for children. not for children. I mean, probably it. It's for grown adults who have their own credit card. Look! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on, are you surprised? I bought my own Tamagotchi for Christmas. Not really surprised. I can't say that I'm surprised. So. Now that you mention it. <laughs> so, I think I'm going to use a clear pocket for this blue one, but first I have to trim off all the excess. But my Tamagotchi, I'm on my second Tamagotchi. Because my first one, I don't know, now she's working on being a, being a pilot. Okay. They, they, they do careers when they grow up. Just like real children. So I'm going to trim off the excess, and remember don't trim too closely to the edge, otherwise it will pop, pop open. And I think I put my bookmark in here, um, not even because that's my life. But when you do it, make sure you get it even. <laughs> yeah, don't be like me. You make sure you get your shade even. I did a good job on the second one though, so that's a thing. So I'm going to trim the bottom right here so that it is also even, mostly, kind of, it's fine, don't worry about it. And then I trim off the top right here. And I'm going to go in with my scissors and just kind of follow the outline of that. I'm going to round the corners, I think. I think I can round the corners on the top, if I remember correctly. Where's my corner chomper? Nope, maybe I can't. Did you just? That was not me. Yes, it was, actually. I watched you bump it. No, I didn't. Okay, well, I didn't even touch it. You just did right now. Oh, it's because I'm getting up off the couch. Here, hold it. Because I need to get off the couch. Good lord. Oh. <laughs> this child, you guys. Look. <laughs> this child. Look. Oh, I saw that. Oh! Did you fix it? I guess so. My oh, it's populous. It's a miracle. It's a Christmas miracle. Fucking <laughs> March. Almost April. Alright. 
So, hopefully. So, there we go. And I rounded the corners down here and I kind of did it freehand up here. So, now I'll show you what to do with these adhesive pockets that everyone is obsessed with in the planner community. I also am obsessed with these. So, they come like this from Target. And I like these ones because they are fully adhesive. Like every spot on the back of this is adhesive. I got some of those Heidi Swap ones and I was a little disappointed because only one little strip right here is adhesive and one little strip right here. That's some grade A bullshit. That's some grade A bullshit. So basically you just peel it off and you stick the thing wherever you want. You probably paid more for the other one. The Heidi Swap ones? Yeah. Yeah, I paid like five or six bucks for them. And how much did you get? Um, four? Something like that? Four or five? Oh. So there you go. That's a clear pocket, of course. And you can put this right in your traveler's notebook look how cute I don't know why I'm talking with a southern accent what's wrong with me there you go so there is that one and we will finish off the one for my ring belt so same thing Trim, and then the top. So we're going to do basically the same thing, right? Except I'm going to hole punch this one. So I'm going to round the corners. This is not perfect because your girl is not perfect. Okay, and then I will use my I like the half inch, you can use the quarter inch, you can do whatever you want. So let's see, I'm going to use my Repesco, I don't know, like this is supposed to be an A5 or personal compact size, I cannot figure out how to use this thing A5 for the life of me. But for personal size, all you do is kind of stick it in. And I turn it this way, like this way, so that I can make sure it's even on both sides. And then I punch. And what I'm going to do for this one is I'm going to slit the holes. But first, I'm going to put a pocket on. Is it, am I going to do this pocket? Did we decide on that one? Okay, I'm going to put this pocket on. This one pocket. Yeah, this pocket fits. So this one came with the Planner Society kit this month, and I like these as well because these are fully adhesive. Like the whole thing on the back is sticky, and that makes me real happy. So I'm just going to stick this one on the front. And I'm going to go a little bit crazy and I'm going to stick another one, one of the Target ones on the back. And then, I mean, you can stick whatever you want in here. Stickers, post-it notes, 
die cuts, all of the things you can stick in these little adhesive pockets. Can you please not? <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to slit the holes just like this. This way I can put it in my ring bound planner and not have to open the rings. So it pops right in just like that. And when I want to move it, I can just pop it out and stick it up here if that's what I want to do. So there you go guys. That is how you make these little bookmarks. They're super easy. I'm sorry if you guys couldn't see that well. One other thing though, those adhesive pockets from Target, I stick those everywhere. I stuck one on the back of my planner right here and I have some post-it notes and a little clip clipped on it. So I mean you can really put them anywhere you want. I've seen them stuck in the side, inside of leather planners. So you can put them anywhere you want to. All right, guys, this has been a really long video. Thank you so much for watching, and I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.